Welcome to the Wednesday Drive for Girls Golf at the Nota Begay III Junior Golf National Championship. My name is Taylor Burr, and today we are joined by three-time LPGA Tour winner, Nellie Corda. Nellie, thanks for joining us today. No problem. Happy to be here. First off, the LPGA is just about ready to return to play. How excited are you for the tour to get back to action? Oh my gosh, so excited. I mean, it feels like it's been forever since I've played my last tournament. Um, it's definitely been nice to kind of spend some time at home, um, spend some time with family, but I'm itching to get back out there. You know, my competitive fire is definitely itching to get back out. I'm sure this layoff was tough for everyone. With that being said, what have you been doing most during this quarantine? Uh, I've been actually super lucky. So all the golf courses have been open. Um, my trainer, you set up a gym in his garage. So I've been training and practicing every single day. And I got to spend some quality time with my boyfriend that I don't really usually get to do and as well as with my family. So, you know, I've been training and just chilling, really. It's been nice, but definitely ready to get back out there. Yeah, with everything going on, it's great that you can get out there and play. Yeah, for sure. Now, this is the longest you've gone without playing a golf tournament. I wouldn't even know. I mean, I guess actually this year, I would say, because during junior golf, I would play like probably 10 events a year, but they would be spaced out to where I would have max maybe a month. But sometimes my dad would give me summers off to just be a kid. So, um, yeah, I would say maybe three months would be the longest. Yeah. So you're currently ranked second in world rankings. What are your goals for this shortened season? Um, I would just say to stay consistent throughout the year. That's been my goal every year. And um, that's something I always focus on. It gets hard out there playing week in, week out. And um, your body, it takes a toll on your body traveling, getting up early and all that. So just staying consistent and healthy is probably a goal of mine. So Nellie, you turned professional as an 18-year-old. How did junior golf prepare you for the highest level of competition in the world? Junior golf and professional golf are two different monsters. I mean, completely different. I think I played AJGAs growing up and definitely, you know, playing in the invitationals with the best junior golfers in the world definitely prepared me somewhat. But when you get out on the professional tour, it's just a completely different animal. Um, you know, as I said, you know, in junior golf, I would play 10 events a year and here I'm playing four weeks in a row. So really like listening to your body and um, is definitely important as a professional golfer. But um, yeah, it was super nice. I loved my junior golf career. I made some great experiences and, you know, playing alongside girls that are even out on tour now, you know, we all have some great memories. Well, most 18 year olds are seniors in high school. So yeah. it's amazing how much you've accomplished at such a young age. Do you have a favorite junior golf memory growing up? Uh, yeah, I would say playing in Junior Solheim Cup. Uh, that was awesome getting to represent my country. And we also did it in um, Germany. So that was really cool. Well, last question. You play golf on television for a living. What advice would you give the finalist of the Nota Begay the third Junior Golf National Championship that will play on the Golf Channel? I would just probably say to soak it all up. It's such a cool experience getting followed by a camera. Um, you know, it's a little nerve wracking, but I would just say for all of them to just soak it up because it's such a cool experience. Well, that's great advice. Nellie, we wish you the best for this upcoming season. Thank you for coming on the Wednesday Drive for Girls Golf. I'm Taylor Burr. Have a great day. Thank you.